the making of my mobile STEM classroom trailer, part one, installing the sound panels. So the top shelf, I decided to do sound panels because there's no anything soft to soak things up. So I hung these up and I love them, but I just need to cut these bad boys in half. But these are courtesy of my dad's donation. There was this piece covering the seam, so I ripped that off and cleaned up the edges a little bit. I did end up adding some caulk and some paint before installing those sound panels. Now, messy bun, get it done. I did measure this little area before ordering and this whole trailer was actually a mobile boutique that sold clothing before so this was the space that I had to work with so taking off some things that I don't know what it was used for and visually measuring one last time before I took off the sticky back of these panels and hung them up. They were super easy and I just really wanted to make sure I lined them up so you could see that cute little design. All of these buckets, once these are hung up, all of these will go up here. They fit perfectly. On the bottom, I'm gonna put some Velcro and on the top so that they won't slide around when I'm driving around. I was able to put one whole panel on that top row and then I measured and cut the other layer in half so they fit perfectly. I love how it turned out. I know you can't see it all the time, but it really does make a big difference with the sound in this space. If you love this video, follow along for more mobile STEM classroom adventures.